she says. She says. <laughs> Why am I laughing? I'm not laughing. It's not funny. It's very important. So check it out. identifies as a cat and his school is not taking that seriously and I am honestly planning on suing them. So yesterday was the first day of school and during class he was licking his paws and his teacher um, told him to stop and he didn't. So she called me and she was like, hey, you have to get your son to stop doing this during class. It's really distracting to the other kids. And I was like, I'm not going to tell my son that he can't express himself. I have raised my son to be who he is. And I just think that it's really sad that these schools are trying to indoctrinate children and, you know, putting them in this mold to make them think that they they need to be, they need to act like a human, whatever that means. He's not, he's not a human. He's a cat. Anyway, I, I am planning on suing them um, because they don't accommodate for him. And uh, I just want to know if there's any other parents out there that are having this issue because we can put together a class action. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Listen, the crazy people are now having kids. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> All right. So listen. The thing is this. With all these um Listen, bring back fear of God and bring bring back shaming people. I believe that because people are not afraid to be ashamed or laughed at like crazy by the rest of society, we have this. And listen, a few years ago, people were scared to laugh at the idea of somebody that is seriously saying, yeah, yeah, they're telling him to act human, whatever that means, whatever that means. <laughs> he was licking his paws. <laughs> Yo, bitch, shut the fuck up. That's what you need to do. And listen, everybody needs to have some courage. People at school need to tell the parents, listen, you have... This is the last time you get a warning. After that, your son is fired from this school and you pay a fine. And we're calling social services because this makes no sense. And it's crazy that for all these years, people are so scared to say something to these people that now, yeah, Listen, kids can play whatever they want because they're kids, they have imagination, etc. Parents are supposed to create the little borders and I don't know, man. It's <laughs> I was like, yo, seriously, say yo. He was licking his paws and the prophecy is distracting to other kids. Yeah, because they think your son is a crazy motherfucker. That's what's happening. Yo, like, listen, what is crazy is that if you tell the truth about all these lunatics, you are the ones who have problems. All right, listen. All right. This is this this is the new this is the new reality. It's it is what it is. So um courage. You got this mama. You got this.